Welcome to Isla Nublar, and welcome to Jurassic World. <laughs> But people just needs a little adjustment. Today, Mr. Masrani, I'm sure your newly promoted assistant manager of park operations can handle it. You want bigger egg cups for the spinner ride? A stegosaurus kick line stage show? No, but those are all excellent ideas. Claire, someone is coming to Jurassic World. Someone with the power to destroy us all. My dreams, following in John Hammond's footsteps, building an even bigger, better, more successful dinosaur theme park than he ever did. Oh, coffee. <sighs> it could all be going up in smoke. Sir, what are you talking about? Who's coming to Jurassic World? Larson Mitchell. Oh, who? The most influential theme park critic. He wants to see our new features like my secret exhibit, the dinosaur carousel. One negative review from him could sink everything I've accomplished. It can't be that bad. Do you know how many parks Mitchell's reviews have closed? Cheeseland, Smelltown, Tooth Fairy Mountain, Euro Cheeseland. Okay, okay. It's no problem. We'll just make sure Larson Mitchell sees Jurassic World in the best possible light. Excellent. You'll give him a private tour and show him only the cool stuff about Jurassic World, not the stuff that doesn't work or still needs fixing. But sir, tours aren't really part of my job. Claire, you're assistant manager of park operations. This situation needs managing. And make sure your tour brings him to my office. Something cool, some... <gasps> Eyes on me. One more time, girls. Blue, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Echo, single file. Oh, come on. All I'm asking is for you to line up just once. Hey, it worked. You did it. No, Owen, you did it. Oh, hey, Dr. Hernandez. You've actually trained dinosaurs, and you were only hired two weeks ago. It's amazing. Yeah, I can't believe it either. Apparently, the key is to forcefully show a young theropod pack you're the alpha and you're in charge. We, uh, still have some work to do. I'm a long way from trying this on larger, more mature dinosaurs. But the principle should be the same. You want to try feeding them? Uh, for now, I'll stick to making them better when they're sick. Owen, come on! It's an emergency! What's the matter? No time! Let's go. Stella, can I borrow your Jeep? Uh, of course. Yikes. Okay. Call me if you wind up with indigestion. <sighs> Mr. 
Mr. Mitchell, welcome. Will you please tell me what the emergency is? I'm Claire Deering, assistant manager for park operations. This is Owen Grady, our lead animal behaviorist. I hope you had a nice journey. I did not. There is no VIP cabin on your ferry. Note for Jurassic World review, minus three Mitchell merits. Well, you're really here for the park, not the ferry, right? <laughs> um, okay, shall we start your private VIP tour? Tour? <gasps> A guided tour means I'd see only what the park wants me to see. I'd prefer to explore on my own. Of course. Let us at least give you a ride to the park's main area. If you insist. Hmm, muddy Jeep. Minus two Mitchell merits. You pulled me away from my work to help you give a tour? Just call it a favor to Mr. Masrani. This means a lot to him. Sorry, gonna need a better reason than that. Come on, Red. How about because I'm the person who signs your paycheck? <sighs> I guess it's almost time for a lunch break anyway. Whew. Finjin Prescott here. I've arrived. Ah. Haven't seen an island like this since that little dust up of the lost salad fork of Lower Slobovia on the island of Bula Bula. <laughs> anyway, without the third piece of the map you sent me, how do you expect me to find this lost treasure of yours? You're the renowned explorer and fortune yeah. hunter. Start exploring and hunting. I'm working on finding us an accomplice in the park. I'll meet up with you later. I just need to stop at our security complex. You know, we've made huge strides in efficiency and crisis response time. I should hope so, after the Jurassic Park fiasco. <laughs> oh, oh, we don't talk about that. Case is ready. Hup, hup, hup. Oh, oh, oh. Pilot, ready capture now. Looks like Security Director Hoskins is running a training exercise with his highly trained team. Good. Move in and keep zapping. Note for review. No, wait. Uh, this is a two-part exercise. First, a crisis occurs. Then the crisis is solved. They're just practicing the first part. Come on, guys. That was great. Let's do it again. Vic Hoskins. Meet our guest, theme park reviewer, Larson Mitchell. Oh, hey. I read your takedown of Euro Cheese Town. Nice one. <laughs> Claire, tell you about our new tasers? Pretty sweet, right? Any relic of a reptile looks at us cross-eyed, and we'll zap him with 36,000 kilometers. <laughs> Mommy. Oh, um, I'm sure Vic did that on purpose <laughs> as part of the exercise. He'll explain when he wakes up. What is it, boy? Oh, awesome. to give you a better view of the command post. Isn't the, um, architecture stunning? <sighs> now, let's get you to the park center like you wanted. This is the worst tour ever. You'll notice one of our state-of-the-art monorails. Looks like our gyrosphere ride is especially popular today. The gondola sky ride gives guests a bird's eye view of the park. And you'll notice the increasingly cranky animal behaviorist in the next Jeep over. <laughs> Just going to take a little shortcut now. Q. 
Can't you at least pretend we're on the same team? I thought I was pretending. <laughs> all right, all right. Hmm. The park seems to have everything. Everything but dinosaurs. Note for review. You might want to wait before making that note, Mr. Mitchell. Dr. Henry Wu and Dr. Allison Miles, two of our lead scientists, working in sync in our cutting edge lab to perfect creating our dinosaurs. Are the different DNA samples bonding, Dr. Wu? Dr. Wu, Dr. Miles, this is Larson Mitchell. Maybe you've seen his theme park review site? They are bonding, just as I theorized. Actually, Dr. Wu, you theorized the modified DNA samples wouldn't combine, remember? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm quite sure you didn't hear me correctly. I said they wouldn't not not combine. Maybe you doctors could tell us. I could write a groundbreaking paper on this. I could really show my old classmate Schweitzenbaum who the better biogeneticist is with this discovery. But, but you haven't proven anything yet. I've prepared a battery of tests. I think we should run. That could take weeks, Allison. If I don't publish quickly, Schweitzenbaum might beat me to the discovery. Some great advancements have come from disagreements in the lab. As a fellow geneticist, I remind you, it's test, prove, then publish. We'll let you get back to work. Will you please stop fooling around? I want to make sure my keyboard is clean before I compose. Uh, find us some moist towelettes, please. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Thanks for the tour, but I'll show myself around for a while. No, wait. I know Mr. Masrani really wanted to meet you in person. What's that? You say attendance at Jurassic World is way up? And customer dissatisfaction and dinosaur rampages are way down? What a splendid report! <laughs> now then, you must be Larson Mitchell, and you are <gasps> not here. Oh no, he must have sneaked away to take his own tour of the park. If he sees anything to criticize, or if anything happens to him... Nothing's going to happen, because we're going to find him. Notes for review. Time for a real overview of Jurassic World, free from corporate flunkies. <gasps> well, well. Looks like Mr. Theme Park Critic wants to go for a little ride. Ride is very smooth. Eight Mitchell merits. Let's see what we can do to ensure a bad review. Glass bottom, ideal for viewing dinosaurs. Four Mitchell merits. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Minus 15 Mitchell merits. <laughs> there! He's on the gondola ride! That gondola ride was supposed to be closed for cable repairs. How long have you been watching? Junior Park Utility Specialist Danny Niedermeyer, sir. I just saw it. 
I was about to call. Well, Mitchell shouldn't be in any danger, as long as that cable holds. Oh, what a relief. And of course, there's no emergency call button. I have to use my phone to call for help. Minus five more merits. I am no longer relieved. Danny, call security. Have Vic Hoskins get his team to the T-Rex paddock. No, don't. Zapping that T-Rex with tasers will only make her angry. We have to do something! So let's get over there and see if we can't handle this ourselves. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Red, you and Mr. Mizrani stay here and don't let anyone up to this platform. <laughs> She's uh, very good, don't you think? <laughs> <sighs> Shall I get us some snow cones? Very well. I've got the experience with dinosaurs. I'll handle this. I made you part of this problem. I'm going to help you solve it. Minus 20, Joe Merritt. Minus 25. Minus 30. Minus 150. We have to get down there. But how? And hold tight. Okay, but what's the plan? Daring rescue. We better get a bunch of Mitchell merits for this. No one's been rescued yet. The gondola is too damaged. The cable can't take the stress. Do something heroic. What? Like go down there and tell the T-Rex to knock it off? Yeah. Could you do that? Never tried this before, so if anything happens, will you take care of Red for me? Oh, that inspires confidence. Okay, then. <sighs> Look at me, girl. Calm down. Forcefully, forcefully, knock it off. You're not the alpha here, I am. Do not mess with me! Unbelievable. Whoa. She's listening to him. Back off! Uh, she shouldn't threaten us anymore. At least not for a little while. We'll take those Mitchell merits now. Uh, fine, fine. You've got them. <laughs> Don't worry, Uncle Dennis. Maybe this plan to bring down Jurassic World in your name didn't work, but I've got lots of others. <laughs> that dumb lizard just a little bit because you don't need to. She's pretty busy if you haven't noticed. Why have tasers if you can't zap dinosaurs with them? <laughs> Mr. Mitchell! Mr. Mitchell! Uh, I certainly hope this experience won't influence your review, Mr. Mitchell. Are you kidding? This place has so many safety issues, it makes Jurassic Park look like Uncle Scribbly's home for wayward squirrels. A squirrel park? Genius! But I'm convinced you have the people, the team, to keep Jurassic World running smoothly until all the kinks are worked out. Splendid, splendid. 
Now, let's take you somewhere where you can relax. And uh, we can work on the rest of your review together. Well, back to work, I guess. Thanks for helping out. Wait, you never told me. Why did you want me to come on the tour? Uh, Mr. Mizrani wanted Larson to see what was cool about Jurassic World. And, well, you were the first thing I thought of. Hang on. You think I'm cool? In what specific ways am I cool? Is it my confidence? No. Is it my coolness under pressure? No. Is it my vest? Okay, relax. It's the vest. And can you please clean all of this up? Honestly, I can't be expected to achieve scientific immortality in such a messy lab. <gasps> Hello, accomplice. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. I just came in to replace this circuit board, and I couldn't help overhearing. Who are you? I'm Danny. Just another unappreciated cog in the machine of Jurassic World. Like you. I know exactly how you feel. And I think we might have a lot in common.